wazazi sasa wameanza kujipanga upya kuhusu namna ya kuwashughulisha watoto wao katika muda wa miezi sita ijayo siku chache tu baada ya serikali kutangaza kuwa shule zitafunguliwa mwakani wazazi wengi wanazungumzia kibarua kilichoko huku wana saikolojia wakisema ni wakati bora kwa wazazi kuwajua zaidi watoto wao Maria Nyambura anaarifu zaidi Susan Wambogo mama ya watoto wawili ni mmoja wa wazazi walioathirika na agizo hilo. Juma hii yuko hapa nyumbani kwa wakijaribu kukagua jinsi mwanawe wa kwanza Melanie anavyoendeleza masomo yake. Susan ananieleza kuwa amejipata katika njia panda kwani changamoto ni nyingi miongoni mwao ikiwa kwa upande mmoja mwanawe wa kwanza anahitaji umakini zaidi kwani yeye ni mtahiniwa huku kwa upande mwingine mwanawe wa pili Shalini ambaye ni mwanafunzi wa darasa la pili pia akihitaji umakini sawia na wadadake kutokana na umri wake mdogo Jumosi nilikuwa na concentrate na huyu candidate ni kama huyu wa grade 2 amesahau kila kitu Jua tani next year tuseme kama huyu candidate nilikuwa nimejua mambo yake ya uniforms hivyo nimemalizana but unapata at the start the beginning of the year itabidi nirudi tena kubai uniforms either atakuwa amerefuka zaidi atakuwa ameadd weight hizo ni cost siko nimetarajia hapa Melanie anajikakamua kujifunza somo analolipenda lakini Melanie ni mwingi wa mawazo kwani alitarajia kufanya mtihani wake wa darasa la nane mwaka huu japo mambo hayakwenda kama alivyotarajia mamake sasa akitwi kwa jukumu la kumweleza yeye na dadake Shalim kuhusu kinachoendelea corona imekuja sasa itabidi turudie lakini mtu anaboeka kukaa home juu Juu kila sa, ukisoma watoto wanaweza kuja nje kuchezea hapo nje wa kudistract. Zingine ni ngumu juu tu kwa tumefunzwa. Kwa tunaangalia speech ya Magoha and vile react alikuwa alikuwa down sana. Kuna exam watu natumiwa but after your speech mpaka exam sasa ni kama namlazimisha kufanya katika eneo la Rescos na Kuru Mashariki tunampata Mary Musonye mama ya watoto wawili pia akiwa katika pilka pilka za kumsaidia mwanawe wa pili katika masomo kabla kuelekea kazini. Ni jukumu ambalo yeye hulitekeleza kila siku na sasa japo kuna changamoto si haba lazimika kuendelea kwa miezi sita ijayo. To be honest, it's a long way being with the children in the house for a total of around nine months. I've been relying on my daughter to help me out on his homework. But if my daughter is going to open school by September, I have to incur an extra cost of finding someone who can take care of my son when I'm out there hustling. Susan na Mary ni miongoni tu mwa wazazi wa wanafunzi milioni 16 ambao wanatarajia kuwa kwa miezi hizo sita wana wao watasalia kuwa wenye nidhamu. Agada Mumo ambaye ni mshauri na saha akisisitiza kuwa japo changamoto zipo bado kuna matumaini. First of all, create a rapport with your child. Communicate, understand the feelings of this child. Get to know what they are going through, how they are taking this uh, whole situation of the, the, the corona uh, pandemic. Number two, engage in activities with them, such as uh, making a kite, such as creative things like uh, coming up with uh, bottles that are maybe decorated. Miriam Nembura Runinga, Citizen, County Anakuru.